Hey everyone, this is Stevie Richards, and in today's video, it's gonna be a really quick updated review on the Titan Fitness Safety Squat Bar. And the title of the video is why I may not have purchased it, and also why you may not want to purchase this particular safety squat bar. Now, price is not really the issue, 150 bucks. It's a third of the price of the Elite FTS version, as well as the Rogue version, if not more affordable than those. But, you know, saving money does come with a price, no pun intended. And I'm gonna show you some of the things I don't like about this safety squat bar and what I may have purchased instead of this one for the same exact money, as a matter of fact, and taking up just about one sixth of space, which my wife will probably love because this room is filling up very quickly or full. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come around here and I'm just gonna show you, as I did in the initial review, how wide this is. And I'm gonna get into the squat to show you just how wide it is. And I'm over 6'2", 210, so for me, I'm a, I'm a big guy, but for some of my wife's size, this would literally hang off of her shoulders. And even with me, this causes more neck and shoulder pain uh, than I'm really happy about. And, you know, I've had a history of having a broken neck and everything, so that might have, a, you know, another thing to do with it. But this is supposed to take a lot of pressure off your shoulders and neck and put everything on your quads. It doesn't quite put enough pressure off, even though I do feel it more on my legs. I'm gonna show you just exactly how wide it is. So what I'm gonna do is take my DIY bench squat, which as you can tell is about on its last leg, another pun. So I'm gonna step into this and as you come around and see from the front, you're gonna see exactly how wide this is. So you see on me, it's literally hanging right there on the bone of my shoulder, which a lot of people have complained about. So you can imagine somebody that's even shorter than me is gonna have a lot of issues. Stay right there. I'm gonna move this over a little bit and then come back in here. I use the box or bench squat just because I'm still not comfortable with squatting. So this is the way it's supposed to be when you come up here, but look at the spacing right here, especially as I come off how much space there is and how it's kind of sliding back and forth. That's because of the width of the pads. And you can replace these pads, which is a pro, not a con, but you can't get thick enough pads to make up for the space to, to narrow the gap. So as I squat down right here, it's fine, but it's putting undue pressure on there because it's over here. If it was closer, it would be further in and probably be something like that. But I'm moving it around because it's pretty light and if it was heavier I wouldn't have that convenience to do that so when I squat up it's fine I feel more on my quads but once again I'm carrying more on my shoulders than I'm comfortable with so I'm much more uncomfortable with this and I know it's the design issue I don't know why they just didn't mirror what the other safety squat bars do elite FTS as well as the rogue and as you can tell, squats blow me up, even when I only do one. But this, it's a great value. There's a lot of people that like using it, and there's guys that probably use it that are much bigger than me. But it's just good to know that this one here for 150 bucks on Amazon is still, in my opinion, not the best buy, especially for a small home gym like this. Come around here. And it's not really a great buy uh, compared to the Dave Draper uh, safety squat bar attachment. I don't know if that's the official name. I'm going to put the uh, screenshot of the product up. But basically, it just takes an attachment. So I already have a straight bar. It takes an attachment, puts it over here, and it's the right width as well as has some padding. And I think you can add padding as well. So that would be the one I would recommend over the Titan if you want to spend around 150 bucks. If you want to go all the way, spend the 350 400 up to 500 bucks for one of the other brands. It might be worth it if you really love the squat, if it's a big part of what you do, and you also have a lot of neck and shoulder issues like I have, because this doesn't necessarily uh, treat those, help those, alleviate those uh, enough for me. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. This is a pretty big uh, <laughs> pretty big thing. I'm not gonna throw it out. My wife will kill me for spending the money and then I end up throwing it out, but it takes up space in the corner. I'm still gonna use it until I find a different solution. Hopefully Dave Draper will get back to me. I've been trying to reach out and contact them with questions comparing this to further that review to see if the Dave Draper version is even better than this than I even know about. So I'm sweating in my eye. But uh, 
Uh, just stay tuned, more updated reviews on this and everything in here. Home Gym Tour for April's coming up too. We're gonna have some new stuff coming in between now and April 1st. And uh, you know, I might April Fools my wife and tell her that I bought a gym. See how she likes that April Fools joke. Probably won't go over too well. So yep, she's shaking her head. She's my camera girl at, at, at uh, 6 a.m. So, and actually Siri is actually dictating my, uh, my speech right now. So I'm sending her a text saying that. Or I'm actually tweeting that, who knows. But if you don't need all this equipment, we're talking about all this expensive equipment. If you don't need that, go to stevierichardsfitness.com. I probably shouldn't do that. And uh, get the 12-week resistance band training program. Very affordable, direct email support with me. Awesome, supportive, closed Facebook group, all for under 15 bucks. And I call it the 12-week resistance band training program, but you can scale it and pretty much do it for up to a year at the 12-week price it's less than 18 cents a day. So you can scale that almost to a full year of workouts, which God, it's less than a penny a day at that point. Thank you guys, God bless you, and have a great day. What are you doing? What are you shooting? Stop, what are you doing? Get it, no, don't do that. <laughs> hmm. Booty. <laughs>